You're the greatest. <laughs> You know, the great thing about cards is that uh, there's so many different things that you can do with them. I've seen uh, guys get an hour of comedy uh, out of a deck of cards, and I've seen people hold a room full of two, three hundred men spellbound with stories about gambling and anecdotes about this sort of thing. So uh, now, if you happen to be a card player, like you like blackjack or poker, this sort of thing, people that play with cards actually tend to like magic or demonstrations with cards that kind of follow more along the game playing regulations, stuff like that. Magic with cards is a little different than the demonstrations of uh, gambling abilities and stuff. So I'll show you one of each, kind of a gambling thing that follows the regulations of uh, poker playing and stuff like that, and one that follows more the theatrics of uh, just, um, you know, the magic stuff. So uh, we'll use the four aces for this just uh, uh, to make them nice and easy to remember. It has kind of a nice uh, gambling uh, connection to it anyway. We'll take the four aces. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. I'll take the four aces and we'll have a little kind of a gambling demonstration here. So here's what I'm going to do. Uh, uh, you know, I'll have the uh, first ace here and I'd like you to just cut it into the deck, cut the cards and complete the cut one time. Very good. No way I could have known uh, where you were going to cut that card to. I want to take the, uh, the next ace, and I'll place it in, and I'll give it a cut, just like this, losing that one in. Uh, if you can uh, place the next ace anywhere, give it a cut. Very good. And I'll take the final ace, I'll place it in, give the cards a cut. Now, isn't it interesting, after those straight cuts, you know the saying, put your faith in the Lord, but always cut the cards? Right. Yeah? Well, there's a reason why they say that. That's theirs. Oh, four aces. <laughs> and those, of course, are the only four aces uh, uh, in the entire deck. Isn't that neat?